What's going on guys, Ben from the Heroes for Fun Guild. Um, I'm gonna be doing a quick video showing a run at Sleepers. Um, it's just a quick video, real simple, straightforward. Uh, you wanna make sure that you have Fire Endo. Um, you wanna make sure you have a weapon that can bypass defense. Um, and you just want to have, for me, I have 150 meat and 150 grape juice and then about 100 fly wings because you be jumping all over the place. It's nice to have a good setup where you have like a priest in town that can warp you straight to um, the straight to the map um, and then having your um, endo slave um, or sage um, right outside the warp so that way you can butterfly wind back to town warp back in using your warper endo and go back at it um, and you just want to rinse and repeat constantly killing um, sleepers and you know mobbing them getting as many as you can if it's a quiet day it's you know you can make anywhere from 2.5 million or 2 to 2.5 million zenny per run um, so i definitely suggest this method and if you have questions on it feel free to comment below but just make sure that you are endoing with fire endo if you have that um, weapon that bypasses defense and you are just going in there and hitting them at least one to you know maximum two hits that should be all it takes um, and then you're you're warping out and jumping into the next uh, the next monster find the next monster and next mob so here we go here's the video check it out so you see I'm already on the map. I have my fire endo. Uh, I'm just gonna go ahead and hit some of these sleepers. I'm warping around. I'm gonna fast forward this, but I did a quick little 15 minute run um, just so that way I can get a good tester. But that's one of the reasons why you want fly. We just wanna jump around, hit these things, and then dip out, go find another mob or another monster, grab the great nature, uh, and then you're good to go. Uh, weapon and kin that you wanna use is something that's gonna be able to penetrate defense and bypass the defense. I'm using an ice pick gonna run you anywhere from 14 to 18 mil um, but you can use just some cheaper weapons and rental weapons that you can use too as well um, here you can see I'm breaking the, the items down so every great nature that you do after you do the quest uh, for every 15 you can get anywhere from 92 to 100 um, green lives you're gonna drop that off into your storage if you're on a you know on an LK like mine um, and then give it to your merchant and have them sell the green lives after you're done. One thing I suggest doing is doing the Umbala quest on a merchant, so that way you can just take all the great nature, put it in your um, storage or your, your cart, bringing it over and breaking them down. You can make anywhere from two to 2.4 million using this method, and it's a great way to make Zenny. So hopefully you guys enjoyed this video. Um, if you are interested in coming and playing this game, it is a Ragnarok private server, Ragnarok online private server. Um, and you can go to talonrow.com, download the game. If you want to come and join our guild, go to the town of Islude, talk to any of our people at the Heroes for Fun guild, um, and they will tell you exactly how you can join our guild. Thank you guys for watching the B3S1 gaming channel. Um, hopefully you like, subscribe, and leave a comment below if you have any questions about the game itself or other games you'd like to see played. Um, this is one of our first videos, so we plan on doing more videos moving forward. Um, so if there's any suggestions on games that you want to see us play, um, feel free to leave it in the comments below.